Hi, I'm Anastasia from Tech City News and this is your Week in Tech. Today we're at Pillbox, a brand new workspace focusing on fast-growing businesses in the heart of Bethnal Green. It's another London success story this week with payments app YoYo raising $5 million in funding. The startup's just one year old and already rolling out across universities in London. The app combines payment and loyalty points in one simple scan. YoYo works by generating unique QR codes for each transaction, and people said QR codes were dead. GoPro is the next American giant to list for IPO, hoping to raise $100 million. GoPros are used for extreme sports and by broadcasters and bloggers. The company is valued at $2.25 billion, and the rumor is that they're about to go on a startup spending spree. It's music to Rolly's ears as the London startup have raised $13 million for their award-winning product, the Seaboard Grand. Rolly's Seaboard Grand is a radical new musical instrument that looks like a futuristic piano with a soft touch surface. Here's Jamie Cullum trying it out. There's a year-long wait list at the moment, but with this new investment, we'll be seeing a lot more of this instrument in the future. Our download of the week has been dubbed the thinking man's Tinder, but it promises to be much more than just a dating app. Here's co-founder Daigo Smith to explain his app, Love Flutter. Love Flutter is a new dating app that helps put your personality first through a quirky fact. We're more than just a dating app, we suggest great places to date nearby too. Love Flutter or Tinder? You decide. Love Flutter is free to download on iOS now, if you fancy a Flutter. And finally, voters have been warned not to take selfies in the polling booths or they may face a £5,000 fine or even six months in prison. So leave your phone in your pocket. This has been your Week in Tech. For more, check out Tech City News and follow us on Twitter.